Hey kiddos, it's Pastor Elizabeth here and I am glad to be with you. Thanks for tuning in. We love you, we miss you. I hope you're doing well. And hey, so today is a special day. Today is what the church calls Pentecost. I know that's a big word. Why don't you say it with me? Pentecost. And let me tell you what Pentecost is all about. Pentecost is about when we remember the gift of the Holy Spirit. Maybe you've heard uh, people talk about the Holy Spirit before. Now the Holy Spirit is much like the wind. And you know a lot about the wind living here in the Tri-Cities, right? Maybe you've been outside and uh, you can't see the wind, but you feel the wind, right? Maybe your hair is blowing in the wind or you see the leaves blowing in the wind. Maybe you even hear the wind. Let's listen. Do you hear that? It's kind of like a low sound. Well, in the Bible, it talks about when the Holy Spirit came on the church. It was like the sound of a blowing wind, like what we get here in the Tri-Cities. And some people couldn't believe their ears. They didn't know what to make of it. But we know today that that was the Holy Spirit. We can't see the Spirit, but we can feel the Spirit. And in fact, one more thing I want to show you is a little setup I have here. This is, these are some pinwheels. And so every time the wind blows, the pinwheels turn. Let's see. Do you see that? Sometimes they get really going fast. There we go. And so even though we can't see the Holy Spirit, we know that it's there. And it's oftentimes working in people, in us, right? Maybe we're sad and we go to the Bible and we read a verse and all of a sudden we feel encouraged. We feel at peace and we have joy. Or maybe we're just feeling not very confident about doing something we've been asked to do. And the Holy Spirit comes right up alongside us and all of a sudden we have the confidence, we feel better, we feel able to do something. That's the Holy Spirit at work in us. So I want us to pray about this special gift that God has given us in the Spirit. Would you join me? Let's pray. Dear God, we love you. Thank you for loving us. And we thank you this day especially for your gift of the Holy Spirit that is our helper that is our encourager. God, thank you that the Spirit is always among us, even though we can't see it, we can feel it, and we can see what it does in us and in other people. Be with us this day, encourage us, make us strong, and give us grace. In your name, amen. Bye for now. See you next week.